up, CNA squad? What's up, squad? It's Charnay and Asia. And we are back with another video. Babe, tell me what we're doing today. Well, today, as you can see, we have spaghetti. We just made spaghetti. And then we're going to be doing assumptions about us. So we're mm -hmm. going to be saying things that people think about us and speaking on them. Right. So let's get into it. All right, you guys, babe, I'm going to let Babe go ahead and get hers first. You sure? Yeah, Babe didn't want one, but I may be a... Uh... See the side, it's just rooming lettuce with cucum baby cucumbers and mozzarella. Then I have this, ooh, the new Caesar we like. Mm -hmm. So good. It's really good. I can get this open, y'all. Mm -hmm. But yeah, we've been waiting to do these assumptions about us. Yeah. Because people always got something to say. They sure do. Y'all don't even know what the TV. Mmm. Mmm, let's do some more. Do you need to get a spoon? Oh, no, it's fine. I got it. I just need to hang out. Stir this up. But yeah, we got um these new cucumbers. They're so good. They're the baby ones, the little teeny ones. Oh, you put it in your salad? Yeah. That's why I asked you, did you want one? You can take some on you. Oh, no. I didn't want any. Take some? I'm all right. Yeah, we got our Parmesan cheese. Yes. I love Parmesan cheese. So good. You guys, we're just gonna fix our plates. We're starving. Mm -hmm. All right. mm. This is the first meal of the day. Let's try. Mm. You guys, I gotta be careful because I'm messy. Mm -hmm. mm. For some reason, we thought we got a uh, turkey. I think this is. We actually turkey. got chicken, chicken meat. We we're supposed to get ground turkey. I don't mm. know how we did that. Because they look the same, so I yeah. think that's why. But in here is just kielbasa, turkey. I put tomatoes. Mm, it looks really yummy. Mm -hmm. Babe actually helped cook the meat. Yeah, oh, I did. I <laughs> helped cook the, uh, the meat. Yeah. It looks good, y'all. Even though it's chicken, it looks really good still. Give me a little extra over here. All right. And you want some cheese? Yeah, I'm gonna put that to the side. Okay. See us eating. I can say that up. Yeah. All right, you guys. We're gonna go ahead and do a little feast. Mm -hmm. Let's do a little thumbnail, babe. Oh, thumbnail. You ready? That should be good, I guess. Yeah, hopefully. Okay, let's say our grace and let's get into it. God bless this food from this one. I pray that in Jesus' name, I pray. Amen. 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 I'm going to take some salad first, y'all. Mm -hmm. Cucumbers, some mozzarella cheese. Mmm. Pretty yummy. How is it? Mm hmm. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Normally y'all have two different forks, but today we're just gonna do what you do. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Mm. Good. Mm-hmm. Baby, the mozzarella cheese in here. It's good with mm -hmm. the mozzarella cheese. You want to taste? With the Mm. <laughs> Did you get some mozzarella? I put mm. some in there. It's really mm. good. Oh, buddy. Mm. Oh, that's good, darling. Mm. 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 Yeah, you need a spaghetti. Yeah. Over here, I got Dr. Pepper. My leftover Dr. Pepper from last night. And I got a um, Deer Park kind of water. And I just had a water. Mmm. Huh? Mmm. Mmm, it's still nice and hot. Mmm. -hmm. Mmm. <clears throat> it's even good with the chicken. Mm -hmm. Yeah, 
I didn't think he was going to, but it's really good. So we've never had chicken spaghetti. Mm -hmm. Really good. Oh, look at that. Oh, yeah. We're going to get started on our assumptions. We're eating. But, y'all been hungry. We are hungry. <laughs> we didn't eat breakfast. Today we took um, Charlie to get him his Easter toys. Mm -hmm. Pet Smart. Mm -hmm. So good. Mm. Oh. And if you notice, babe, I just got thin noodles. I noticed something was different. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I said something's different with the spaghetti this time. Mm -hmm. I didn't get regular spaghetti, I want something different. Cause no, we've done bow tie, panini. Regular spaghetti. We haven't done the thin. Okay, but you want me to start? Mm -hmm. All right. So, Mayo has, has the assumptions on the phone. So we're just gonna go down the line. Um, the first assumption about us is y'all got married too quick. Okay. What I'm gonna say to that is, I don't feel like you do. I feel like if you love the person that you're with. And it's in your heart, and you know that's the one for you. Do what you want with that person that you're in love with. Mm -hmm. And we got married, and we decided that we wanted to be with each other for the rest of our lives. So right. why not? What do you think about that, babe? I, um, like, why I feel like, okay, I do feel like I, in the beginning, I did kind of like want to rush mm -hmm. the relationship. In the beginning, I did because I already knew what I wanted, and I already had my time wasted for eight years right um in my last relationship so excuse me so i didn't want to waste any time mm -hmm. so i don't like you know people could see it as us moving quick because we got engaged after six months mm -hmm. um we moved in after six months and you know we did a lot of things that people do after being together for years so right. we did the things we did those things i guess you can say quick but in our eyes, it wasn't really quick because we knew what we wanted. Exactly, and it was perfect. Mm -hmm. Like it was right. for us, it felt like it was on time. Yeah, like I felt like it was on time. It was. I don't feel like it was rushed, and I don't feel like we got married too early. I just felt like we did what was in our hearts. Mm -hmm. and we're happy, and our marriage is going perfect. Our marriage is going great. Yeah, because mind you, we were uh, we were engaged for mm -hmm. two years. Yep. Yep. We were engaged for two years, so I feel like, you know. Yeah, I'm sorry. I'm not gonna be. <laughs> <laughs> engaged engaged for, nine nine years. for nine years. <laughs> and I'm definitely not gonna be with somebody not engaged for more than for nine. more than that. No, mm -hmm. that's why I said I I was I was ready to get married as soon as I saw her. I said, mm -hmm. oh yeah, that's gonna be my wife. Ha! <laughs> she did. No seriously. All right. Number two. Our second assumption is y'all never go out. <laughs> <laughs> that's true though. That is true. That's true. No, that assumption is true because we don't we we stay to ourselves. Mm-hmm. We stay in the house, and I feel like there's not really much to do anyway. Mm -hmm. With COVID going on, it's not even really good to be around a whole bunch of people anyway. Like, um, but when we go, when we do go out, we go out together. We go out together. So I mean, it's hey, right? And basically, where we live, a lot of places have to shut down early mm -hmm. because they don't know how to act. So it's just like, why are we gonna go somewhere? And we're not even gonna be there for a long time. Right. And I've done a lot in my day. I've mm -hmm. partied, I've went mm -hmm. out, I've done all that. And it's been like now I'm married, I have a family, like we're doing the more important things in our life. Yeah, it's okay to have fun. We mm -hmm. have fun. We go on our little vacations, we go get hotels and, and do you know, yeah. and do stuff like that. Yeah. Anything else towards that day? Oh no, because that one's true, but like we said, I mean, we just like doing stuff together. Right. <laughs> We just enjoy each other's mm -hmm. presence. Like, and our love. Yeah. And we like being stuck together. <laughs> Three. This is a good one. This assumption, I feel like a lot of people just, I don't know. But anyway, it's Asia is not gay. <gasps> I'm going to let Asia talk to you about that one. Um, I don't even know what to say. Like, I feel like a lot of people... Um, probably think that I'm not gay mm -hmm. or is it it's mostly a shock thing because right. you got to think like I was with guys and I had a long-term relationship with a guy and 
I never identified as gay or you know bisexual nobody or bisexual or, or nothing and nobody knew right so I think when I came out it was more of a shock thing and people were just like really right like what like, how is that how from? she where did it go like so and the thing is I've always been gay mm -hmm. since middle school I've liked ding, girls ding, ding. so um I just never was out with it because of you know <laughs> You know, I was in a religious family, and you know, growing up in church, the whole gay thing was a big right. ordeal. It was an abomination. So, it I never I was scared to come out. Right. So it's not that I you know, just all of a sudden came, I did all of a sudden come out, but it seemed like that to people. But I've been to myself. I was out. Right. To other people, I wasn't. I just had this to hide it. To hide it, and I had this you know barrier up, and I was just like, I can't let anybody know this because this is bad. So, um, but yeah, I'm I'm gay. I'm I'm 100 gay. I wouldn't be married to a woman if I if I wanted. I'm confused. <laughs> I just think about the assumption. Like I feel like if you don't know her that well, you wouldn't have known. Mm -hmm. Like I feel like even her closest friends, her closest family members, she didn't tell you. So I feel like if she wasn't close to you, she's not gonna tell you mm -hmm. her deepest darkest secret. Right. Like, and I feel like no, I did not make AJ gay. That's it. That's all. Nope. Nope. I did not. I did not. I did not bring her out that closet. <laughs> no. The thing is, she was already out that closet. Yeah, I was. Y'all still like men. Oh, this is four. Y'all still like men. Four. No. Okay? No. It, it, it. Okay, <laughs> let me just say this. We have friends who are men. Yeah. Have we dealt with men? Yes. Of course. Being together? Yes. But could could I see myself like marrying a man and do no, I don't. I just men can't excite me anymore. Mm -hmm. I've been with men. I've done everything with a man. Everything that you can think of with a man. It's not exciting. It it just don't get me where I need to be got. Mm -hmm. You feel me? Like it's not the fact that oh men is this and somebody hurt my feelings. No, I just love women. Always have, always will. Yeah, mm -hmm. of course, if you're, when you grow up, your parents ask you, <laughs> like, when you're like, no, I'm, I'm not going to do that. I'm, the whole time, I'm like, okay. whole time, I'm loving her. <laughs> loving her. Yeah, what so, do you think about that, babe? I don't know. I just feel like, I don't know. We we don't like men. Like, but everything you said was right. We, we don't want to be with a man. We don't. A lot of people, this. I see some more people. Mm -hmm. Here you go. A lot of men are in our inbox saying, oh, do y'all need a boyfriend or y'all need a third? No, we don't. No, we don't. We've had our third, fourth, yeah. and fifth. We don't, we don't need, need no more. We're good, just us two. Yeah, no, seriously. You can do this one, baby. Here you go. Okay. I think we're on five. Five. This is a good one. <laughs> Asia is controlling. Look. <laughs> <laughs> Look, we both controlling in our own ways, but Asia is not gonna tell me what, <laughs> when, where, and who. That's the one thing. My decisions are my decisions. Mm -hmm. What I choose to do is what I choose to do. She doesn't control who I hang with. She doesn't control if I don't want to. I'm not going to. It, it doesn't matter. And what people need to understand is, yes, I'm married, and if I want to be just around my wife, that's just who I'm gonna be around. Period. Nothing more, nothing less. Like, I just, she's not controlling. She doesn't stop me from doing anything I don't, I don't want I to. Don't. I don't know why. I think it's because she stopped doing certain things and stopped, you know, but just because she stopped doing certain things, it's not because of me. Mm -mm. It's not because of me. I don't tell her she can't go around people or can't hang out with people. I mean, if I have an opinion about it, I'm going to say it, but I have never, like, stopped her from doing what she wanted to do. No, and if, like I said, and if I stop doing that, it's because I it's don't she want to. to do it, period. Right. And I feel like certain stuff just drain your energy. You don't want to be around stuff like that. Mm -hmm. Like, I, my wife gives me good energy. She's here for me. She loves me. She accepts me for who I am, for everything that comes along with me. So why would I not want to be around that? Exactly. Like, Anyway, that was a good one. Like, she's not controlling. There's a lot of people. We're all that. controlling. Everybody's controlling. Everybody has the controlling ways. A different way. Mm -hmm. So it, it's no next. <laughs> right. Charnay does everything. That's a good one. We gotta speak on it. Yes. I'm sick of people thinking that Charnay just works. Charnay just pays the bills. 
Charlotte. Then this is a team. Do y'all not understand? <laughs> a team. When she's down, I'm up. When I'm down, she's up. So it, it's it, it, it works. Yeah. It, it, it works. And trust and believe. Every bill that we have, we put in together. Mm -hmm. Do y'all know what OnlyFans is? Do y'all know what having your own business is? Mm -hmm. Do y'all know what YouTube is? Do y'all know what having separate jobs is? Mm -hmm. Yes, there's a lot of people of, of us out here that don't want to fucking work. Who wants to work? No At one. this point, we're not the only person, people in this world that have quit jobs, went back here and there. Honey, it's a lot of people. A lot of people go between not jobs. Working. Yeah. Yeah. And Charlie does not do everything. No. Go ahead, baby. I don't know. What I do you think, think about that? I don't know. I just don't like when people think that I don't contribute to the household or the like contribute money or anything. I hate when people think that. Right. Because I do. It's, it was times when I was working and, and I she wasn't. wasn't. And it was times right. when she was working and, and I wasn't. So, and our just, bills are still paid. Yes. So, that's all we got to say about that one. Right. Charney doesn't do everything. No, Charney doesn't. I help, I help too. So. Yes, we do this together. Mm -hmm. Like, Charney doesn't do it by herself. Mm -hmm. And just to believe, if she did, you think she'd be quiet about it? No. no. Right, I'm not going to be quiet about that. No. Like, no, if I feel like my wife need that um, I'm gonna give her that um. Mm -hmm. Just as if I need it, she's gonna give it to me. Exactly. We're not going to let each other be out here hot and dry. How do you think we made it to where we is? Out the mud. Mm -hmm. Like the hug. And if you want to think about it, her family's been doing the damn thing. Charnay mm -hmm. cheats on Asia. No, I don't. I don't. I have no need to. I, I've done all that. I've. <laughs> I'm 30 years old, y'all. Ain't nobody got time to be doing that. First of all, I don't even have two incomes to be supporting two women, two right. men, two nothing. I mean, <laughs> like, I support my wife no, and my real. dog child. Like, what do you think about that, man? What do you think about that assumption? I don't know. Uh, seeing what you said, like, nobody had, uh, you don't even have time to, to choose. Right. <laughs> We don't have time for that. No, none of us do. But you definitely don't even have time. You don't have the energy. Right. You'd be too tired to, too to tired. do anything. Like, <laughs> so I doubt you would be trying to be out here having a double life. Like, no. It is hard. And to be honest, shout out to those who are here doing it. Because I don't know, know how you're doing it. I don't know how y'all doing it either. Mm -hmm. I mean, I've had my moments where I've, you know, had a double life. But now, I couldn't do it. Right. How right. do y'all do how that? Do, like, I couldn't do it do. now. I couldn't. That's, That's too much work. Hiding and sneaking and <laughs> make sure you don't call this person that name and that person this name. I don't know if I got time That's for that. Too much. But if we're getting too old for that, yes. next. Oh, we already touched on the we don't work, so we're not talking about that. Okay. Um, we're stuck guys. up. I mean, I'm certain not. things. I don't think it's that we're stuck up. It's just certain things we don't deal with. Certain people right. we don't deal with. So that doesn't necessarily make us stuck, stuck up. up. It's just certain things we're not gonna do, and that's just it. <laughs> right, and I feel like certain things just aren't fit for us anymore. Yeah. And if I feel like if you want to call us stuck up because we don't want to go here, we don't want to go there, and we don't be out, that's you. Yeah. And maybe sometimes, maybe some people, maybe we are too good to be around certain things. You know what I mean? Like I said, and do certain things. Right. It can turn down your energy. Don't nobody want to be around that. Mm -hmm. on, the same thing y'all doing out there, we can do in the house. Exactly. Together, <laughs> passed out, drunk. <laughs> Hey, that's it. That's all. Like, I don't know. I just, <laughs> we're not stuck up. I mean, bougie a little? Yes. Yeah. No, maybe. You yeah. know? But stuck that's up, it. no. Stuck up? No. No, 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 no. Okay. Number nine. We're almost done. Are you, was this yours? Oh, yeah, it's mine. Okay. Number nine. Number nine, you guys. Okay, this is the one that really, I, I think a lot of uh, film couples deal with no, seriously. this one. They do this, like, too pretty to be lesbians. How are we too pretty, pretty to be lesbians? I never got that. In the comments, can y'all, if y'all understand, because I, I, people have said that. Mm -hmm. I never understood what that meant. Mm -mm. I never understood why people even said that. Like, how, right. how can somebody be too pretty to be gay? Right, it, let me know. How can you be too like, pretty? How's it a, like, how's it a waste? So for all that, I'm too pretty to be with a man. <laughs> if you want, if you want to say it that way, like I'm too pretty to be with a man too. No, you're just too pretty to be with a woman. Make it make sense. How? I, I don't get it. If y'all in the comments, 
want to elaborate on that one, right. please let us know. Please let us know, because I'm confused. I'm know. still confused. A lot of men say it. Yeah, men's, men no, say it's it. not women it's that not say it. It's women. men that say it. Yeah, it's They're like, oh, it's, y'all, are, y'all are too pretty to be uh, with a... Y'all need to be with a man. What? What? No. <laughs> I, no. The fuck? I've had men. Men's. A lot of old, men young. In, <laughs> they, I mean, Trust and believe, honey. Y'all most of them are all the same, so... <laughs> like, yeah. No, seriously. Like, most y'all are just... Ugh. Anyway. Next... I think this is the last one. Yep, the last one. This is the last one, you guys. All right, the last one is number ten. We don't, don't have, have friends. friends. I mean, we, we don't. We don't really. I mean, what well, we have, you know. Yeah, it's friend it's cousins. a few. Like our cousins, basically. Like, if you want to say that, like we have friends, but like I would say acquaintances. I wouldn't really say like. Friends. I have a best yeah, friend. Yeah, you have a, yeah. Yeah, I mean, one of them, like, one of my best friends, you know, passed away, but I do have a best friend. Mm-hmm. Like, that's the only person that I really count as my yeah, best friend. But as, like, but as far as, like, friend friends, we no, don't really we don't have, have friends. Mm-hmm. Like, sometimes you gotta... People, you, you gotta watch your back with people sometimes. No, seriously, because they fake. Yeah. And they fake. You even gotta watch your family sometimes, mm-hmm. you know what I mean? But, no, it's not the fact that we don't want friends, it's just the fact that... We've done all that. Like, we're bored. Next. Like, yeah. <laughs> like we're yeah, best friends. We, yeah, we're friends. We, we're we, good. All we really need is each other. Yeah, right. For honest. real. To be honest. In this world. Because it's, it's, it's... You can't trust fake. a lot of people. No. Mm-mm. People are fake. You can't it's, trust a lot of people. I can't. That's why we do keep to ourselves. That's mm-hmm. why people might think that all these assumptions about us... Because we do keep to ourselves, and we're just with each other all the right. time. But what are you? I mean, when you and when you're married or when you're in a relationship, you want to be with that person right. all the time, right? Why That's with any relationship. Right. And if you don't, honey, you and people get mad, and people, I know people. Some people get mad at couples that are together all the time. Mm-hmm. Like, oh, y'all are always together. What are we supposed to be? Not what, are, what are we supposed like? To couples do? aren't supposed to be together. Well, you should be wanting to be with your partner all right. the time. Right. Because if you're not, you're not happy. That's just me. me. Yeah. Like, That's it's just, just like me. you'd rather be with you know somebody else. Right. Confused. I don't know. But that's none of our business. <laughs> Honestly, that's none of our business. Like, I don't know. Like, we have friends that we feel that need to be friends. Mm-hmm. Trust and believe people that we want to come over here. They come over here. Y'all mm-hmm. just don't know. <laughs> <laughs> that's just it. That's just all. Like, that's all I got to say. But yeah, you guys. I this journey for me is just. It's doing good. Yeah. I finally got my stuff for my hair. Yeah, she's gonna retwist it. I'm gonna retwist soon. it. And like, I don't know. Probably more girly. I kind of look like a tomboy today, mm-hmm. but that's okay. I like it though. She thought that I would be a stud. I don't want to be a stud. I like being a girl. I like being I mean, a girl. What's wrong with being a stud? I like getting my hair done. I like wearing makeup. I like getting my nails done. Tomboy, yes. I like yeah. comfortable hoodies. You're leggings. just a tomboy. Just a tomboy. Yeah. I don't know. I like to be cute. Honey, mm-hmm. hold up. I bow. Out. I bounce out. You know what I'm saying? Yeet. <laughs> but yeah you guys we were so excited to do this mm-hmm. because we just I just felt like we just needed to clear up some stuff you yeah. know like questions people were saying well assumptions assumptions people about had about yeah. us and the thing is we just wanted to bring it to y'all's attention to let you guys know you know how we felt about that mm-hmm. and what else should we say baby nothing I think that was a that was it we that said everything video. yeah we said everything we had to say mm-hmm. on those topics and there you have it <laughs> And there you go. If you do have any more or questions or anything you want us to do, like another Q&A, mm-hmm. please drop your questions down below in the comments. And if you're new here, hello. Welcome mm-hmm. to Charney in Asia. If you're not, please, please, please keep supporting us. We thank you for being here with us mm-hmm. and, you know, building us up and yes. being the consistent subscribers that you are. And make sure you give this video a mm-hmm. like, like, like. Give it a thumbs up. Hit that bell for you so you can be notified when we post a new video. And also, make sure you like, like, comment, and subscribe. Bye!